Setting the trend, mastering English phrases. Hello everyone, welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to dive into a fascinating phrase that's quite popular in English, to set a trend. Understanding this phrase will not only enrich your vocabulary but also help you grasp the nuances of English expressions. So, let's get started. To set a trend means to start a new style, pattern, or behavior that others begin to follow. This phrase is often used in fashion, technology, and social behavior contexts. When someone sets a trend, they're essentially leading the way for others to follow, often introducing something innovative or different. Let's look at some examples. 1. Fashion. The designer set a trend with her eco-friendly clothing line, inspiring others to consider sustainability in fashion. 2. Technology. The company set a trend by introducing the first smartphone with a foldable screen. 3. Social media. His unique way of storytelling on social media set a trend among content creators. These examples help illustrate how the phrase is used in different scenarios. Now, let's see how you can use to set a trend in everyday conversations. When discussing fashion, I think that new style of hats is going to set a trend this summer. In business meetings, our goal is to set a trend in the industry with our innovative approach. Among friends, you always set a trend with your unique party themes. In this section, we explore the impact of people who set trends. Trendsetters often influence public opinion and consumer behavior. They play a crucial role in shaping cultural and societal norms. Understanding their impact helps grasp the full meaning of the phrase. And that's a wrap on, to set a trend. Remember, this phrase is all about initiating something that gains popularity and is followed by others. We hope this video has been enlightening and helps you confidently use this phrase in your conversations. Keep practicing, and you'll soon be setting language trends of your own. See you in our next video.